I thought I would come home and have him waiting here for me. And when I came home and he wasn't here, I knew something was wrong. And I pursued it until I found out. A careless decision cost a local man his life. Good evening, I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Christiane Klein, in for Brian tonight. A suspected DUI driver is believed to have taken the life of a husband, father, and grandfather over the weekend. Now his wife is sharing her fondest memories of him. Shakela Alvarenga joining us now with a story that you only see on 8 News Now. Shakela? Well, Katrina Lamoureux was out of town for her daughter's wedding last weekend. When she got home, she had no clue what had happened. The accident happened within minutes. Her life is now forever changed. His name was George, but he went by Bill. Bill was loved by many. This is my favorite picture of him. His wife Katrina shared these photos with us Thursday night. She wanted people to know who Bill really was. He was a wonderful husband, father, grandfather. Katrina knew something was wrong Monday morning. We didn't know where he was, and I tried to put in a missing persons report, and they told me that it was too early. The paintings on the street along Pecos Road mark the heartbreaking revelation. She found the truth online. A suspected DUI driver hit and killed her husband. People don't know what they're doing when they get behind the wheel and they drink and drive. Um... I was heartbroken. I was crushed. Bill was diagnosed with stage four prostate cancer last month, but Katrina said he was ready to fight. I don't think he understands the wonderful life he took. We love you, Bill. She hopes that by telling his story, it may save a life. It's a wake up call about the tragic and preventable loss of a life. I don't know how I'm going to survive. <laughs> I'll figure it out. I always do. I don't know how I'm going to make it without him. One day at a time. Meanwhile, the suspect has been identified as 36 year old Williams Jones. He is being held on $100,000 bail. Christiane. Heartbreaking. Thank you, Shakela.